Hi, today we're talking about 15 millimeter lenses. Um, so I found myself with a handful of 50 millimeters and realized that I don't really know the difference between them. Uh, so basically I have Samian T 1.5. I have the Canon F 1.4. I have a little vintage, which is actually a 55 millimeter. And I also have this zoom lens, which is a 24 to 105, meaning that hits that 50 mark as well. I just had this frustration of not knowing the difference between them that I thought it would be interesting to do a comparison test. How does the same lens can look different depending on the type of glass and the type of F stop. Ugh. So basically, I did I did the test on my C two hundred. This is look how loud this is. This is what happens when you put raw files into your laptop. So first, we're gonna have a look through all the images, and then I'm gonna talk about the things that I found different and where kind of my preference lies. All right. All right. All right. All right. Uh, so basically for me, the two things that really defined was sharpness and how it reacted to light. Those two really stand out for me in all the lenses. Looking at the 24 to 105 and the 50 f1.4, because they're both Canon, I felt like there was a little bit of a similarity there, but because the f1.5 has a bigger aperture, I had to put it two stops uh to get a similar exposure which gave me a much a much richer depth field so between those two lenses i feel like the 50 did a really nicer job in creating a separation and is they're, they're both nice but they're very you can see a little bit of difference uh when it comes to the background especially uh, I feel like the 50 because f4 f1.5 it gave me a more interesting sharpness in the bottom section of the, the character now the vintage lens is the one that really screamed out the most I think he completely blew the the lights first of all uh, they look like one big thing which can be nice depending on what you're going for uh, that can be very useful. I think doing the stats really show me why certain people really go for vintage uh, overall because they do feel much different. They're much, much softer and they kind of bloom all the lights, uh, which is something usually you would use something like a pro mitts for. Uh, vintage lenses kind of do it by themselves. The Samian 50 is the one that I personally preferred. I feel like the the focus, the, the sharpness of the focus was a lot more precise. It was a lot more I could do with so that it allowed me to kind of go back and forward. And even if you notice, even being able to focus on the sword of that pole or the eyes of that pole, uh, being a 1.4. How the light still a little self-contained, but is a little bloom uh, from the depth field. I think that's something that I, through my eyes really, really works and what I personally like more in my images. Uh, something that I found very interesting is if you notice the, the shelf itself, if you look at the shelf itself through the different images, it's some of them, something like the vintage because it makes a damage so soft, you can now, you almost lose the shelf, uh, which for me is a little too much. I like to be able to still tell was happening around my frame even if the focus is not there i do like the idea of experimenting with different vintage lenses obviously i only did this test with the lenses that i had at home uh but i would be curious to rent out a couple of different types of lenses in redoing a test like this so let me know if that's something that you're interested in and i'll try my best to do it i thought it was a very curious experience to compare these lenses and i know this is not the most in-depth kind of review but i just wanted to feel 
what was the difference? You know, when you're picking the lenses you're gonna bring on shoe and you realize you have three or four different types of the same lenses, why you would pick one over the other? Knowing that difference, knowing what you're trying to achieve and what you have and where those two meet, I found that that was such a crucial thing. I, it was something that when I thought about it, I had to do it immediately. Um, and I'm glad I did. I hope this was helpful for you. I hope it was informative, fun, or something between. If you want to see more, hit subscribe. I post videos here every Monday and Thursday. That's all I have for you today. Goodbye. Bye. 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 Bye.